Hey guys, so a lot of you have been asking how to use the um, sea salt spray, texturizing sea salt spray. We only have um, a few of these left, so if you want this, grab it. I'm hoping that they add it to the catalog eventually, but right now um, it's not in the catalog. So it's, this is an eight ounce container. First thing um, I'm going to remind all of you to do is to give this a good shake when you get it. Remember, we don't use the chemicals to hold the ingredients together. So when you get our products, you may notice some separation. So you want to either give a good mix, um, good shake, good mix, whatever. So um, the big question is, when do you use this? Do you use it on um, wet hair? What does it say? Um, actually, um, I've never really read the directions to this, but <laughs> turns out I'm doing it correctly. Um, so you will spray it all over your hair and you're gonna spray it on damp hair, damp or dry. I've used it on dry hair before too and it does still work. Um, you don't really wanna use it on wet hair. It's not gonna work as well so because you're gonna wanna scrunch it. So. You're gonna spray it on your hair and scrunch it and then um, let it air dry. Um, or if you want extra volume, you can blow dry. Uh, it says blow dry with a diffuser. I don't know what that means. I'm not a good hair person. Is that the thing that like has holes in it? I don't know. Um, I think that's what that means. It's got like the whole things in it and you, anyways, I don't do that. Um, that's too much, <laughs> it's too much. Um, um, oh yeah, and it does say spray on dry hair to add texture, to find curls, or tame flyaways. So I like to use it on um, damp hair or dry hair. So let me just show you real quick. Literally so super simple. So you just spray it all over. And it smells amazing. It smells like coconut. And then you just scrunch your hair. And this, I literally just washed my hair this morning and let it air dry and then for almost all the way and then um, just brushed it through once. And now you guys are like, oh my gosh, Tara, your hair looks crazy now. You wanna scrunch it and then you're gonna um, finger comb it to make it look not crazy, okay? And some areas you might wanna Spray again. You could also um, tip your hair, your head upside down and spray it, but literally just spray it and then scrunch it. Oh, also you guys, another tip with this is um, comment braids if you put braids in your hair at night sometimes to create some um, curl. Another great way to use this is to use it in the morning. So after you do your braids, so do braids at night and then you get um, some of that wave anyways from the braids. And then you will um, use this after and it helps that waviness stay in there and um, it helps um, to define those, those waves too that you got. So it's a double, double whammy. But anyways, you guys can see the waves. And also too, I'll do this, I'll spray this again once my hair dries the rest of the way. Um, it's kind of, yeah, it's a lot drier at the tops of my hair. And in that picture I shared just a while ago, that was when this first came out in a bliss box, um, when my hair was way longer. And I really need a haircut. Comment cut if you need a haircut right now too. So you see, See the waves in there? Little mermaid hair. Super simple, literally takes a couple minutes um, to spray it in and scrunch it. Um, they say to do it on um, dry hair or clean hair. Um, it works really well on um, dirty hair too. Um, so for dirty hair, um, this is going to wet your hair anyways because obviously it's a liquid. Um, but, uh, you can definitely use this on dry hair, um, dry hair too. And like tomorrow, so I just washed mine today. I sprayed this in it tomorrow. Um, I'll spray it in it again 
um, to just uh, freshen it up a little bit. But this works really well, eight ounce bottle, it's gonna last a really long time. Um, and like I said, there's only a few hundred of these left, so if you guys want this, grab it while you can. I'm gonna spray just a little bit more uh, right there. Um, make sure you order it sooner than later, okay? I don't know that that got on my hair. Um, order it sooner than later, and if you've already ordered it, comment order if you've already ordered it. I love I love me a mermaid wave because it's super simple. And you guys know me, I usually have my hair up. Um, <laughs> very rarely do I have my hair um, done. And this spray is awesome. I love it because it's super simple, gives you um, a, a cute, cute look and um, you don't have to do much besides literally spray something in your hair and then scrunch your hair. That's it. Um, this gives you more volume in your hair as well. Like if you have thin hair, comment thin. I have really thick hair, but if you have thin hair, um, it works for thin hair too. If you have curls, it works to um, define those curls. The apple hair mask is really good for defining curls too. I was just looking over here because I thought it was here, but I think actually, you know what? I haven't opened a new container of apple hair mask since I used the last of my last one. So anyways, that's it. I just wanted to make a quick tutorial because so many, you, so many people have been um, asking me about this. So that's it. Done, done. Little Mermaid Wave. Have a great Wednesday, everybody. I'll talk to you soon. Bye, everybody.